Okay, so we just left off where we were fixing the, uh, the corners. We had a permutation parity, which you may or may not run into. Um, and once you do the, the, the algorithm, what's going to happen is it's going to kind of mess up your edges again. So you kind of have to solve your edges all over, and then you have to uh, go ahead and solve your corners. So I'm going to, again, I'm going to show you the algorithm just to make sure that you do have it. And so it's going to be the, this inside layer twice, R2, and then the top U2. The inside layer twice, R2, and then both layers, U2. And then the inside layer, R2, and then both top layer, layers, U2. And again, I've created that, that same parity problem that I had before. And you will notice it because as you're solving for your corners, you'll notice that none of them will get into position or you may have like two of them in position, something strange that you've never seen before. So I have none of them in position and um, if I keep doing this algorithm, it's there's one of them in position right there and I have another one in position right here. So that's not something you would see on a normal three by three. These two are in position, these two are not. So there's nothing I can do that's gonna make all four of them in the correct position. So I can, I'm can. i going to do this again. And this one's in the correct position and this one now is in the correct position. Okay, so there's nothing I can do to make them all in the correct position. So this that's when you have to do this algorithm to uh, kind of fix that. And there we go. Now I have to go ahead and fix my uh, my edges again. And my edges are fixed, so now I have to go ahead. Now I can go ahead and I can solve my corners like I normally would. And my corners are all in the correct spot. Then I would finish the four by four the same way I would the three by three. So I'm going to do the right inverted down inverted algorithm the same way. And once you get it up here, you're going to rotate just the top layer just like you would on a three by three. go now I just need to fix these layers and the 4x4 is now solved thank you for watching the tutorial um, let me know what you think or if this helped you um, solve it um, thank you bye bye